being an international chef, uh, we are required to, um, to master most of the styles and the authenticity of, uh, uh, of different cultures. So we tend not to be having one style of cooking. We need to be, you need to, we tend to diversify our cooking methods and uh, cooking styles and, um, and cuisines. I tend to love uh, um, roulettes. They tend to bring uh, the creativity in me and uh, most of them, uh, I normally infuse them so they are healthy and uh, they, uh, they are, they are eye-catching and always and always they have brought the best in me uh, when I serve them to my guests. They are always a wow effect. I've been nominated um, top chefs of the, of the week um, by a group called uh, East African uh, Consortium. Uh, is, uh, this is, um, is a, cons a consortium uh, from East Africa and uh, it's a big thing. Uh, being nominated from, uh, in East Africa we have like um, 10,000 and above uh, uh, chefs. So you can imagine being a top chef from 10,000 people. It's really a big deal. And, uh, and also it's not about me al al alone. I have, a, I have a team behind me which boosted me. So uh, to all my chefs in, uh, in Mythos, I really appreciate uh, the, uh, the support they gave me. Our vision uh, to start Mythos Hotel uh, was and still is uh, to provide a safe space where our people can uh, uh, come, create, and share special moments uh, together. Since we opened uh, in Middle Hotel, we have uh, primed ourselves as uh, an high-end hotel. We, we have uh, a restaurant, perhaps one of the best restaurants in, in Kigali City. Uh, we have 24 rooms, of which uh, 12 are suites and 12 are standards. We, we have a very nice swimming pool and a garden, and uh, we, we have a fully equipped uh, gym. Uh, Rwanda is becoming one of the top destinations uh, top destination in Africa. Uh, with, with all the, 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 the measures and investments that uh, the government has done through, through Rwanda Development Board, uh, they start to bear fruit. Uh, Pre-COVID, Africa was, was, was also a, a top growth, growth uh, visitors was growing tremendously and we expect post-COVID those numbers will pick up still and yes the future looks looks bright for Africa and specifically for Rwanda.